Hey everybody, welcome back, Falcon, Distant Star, episode number six. Alrighty, so last episode we finally took a real bit of uh, a loss. I mean, we won the mission, obviously, because we're still here in the map, we're still progressing. However, we took our first real, I guess, um, victory spoil, or at least, I guess, loss, I guess, where we actually did have one of our ships, which was Ipic, get disabled. Now, he's got a critical on him now, which again, criticals are negative traits. Which uh, makes it now that his shields regenerate slower. Again, he's a Lancer class, so he only has two bars of shields as it is. So that's going to be really, really unfortunate for us. So we're going to have to take care of Epic more now. Meaning, probably the two Lancers that we, the other two Lancers that we have, will be more forward, and then Epic's going to be even behind that class. So, I mean, so be it. If you guys saw the last episode, you'll see the type of bullshit I was dealt with, and I'm even surprised I survived. To be honest with you. Alrighty, so we have a few jumps over here. We have to jump here. To get to Cardi because I want to get there for sure. So let's jump over here. Hopefully there's nothing too crazy on this one. And it gives me a chance to maybe, I don't know, buy something. Maybe even clear up that critical. That would be pretty ideal as a matter of fact. The, the cargo ships limping across the system send you a distress call. Commander, our medical fragile uh, frigate was destroyed. And we are carrying injured Akari warriors to our station for emer emergency treatment. The enemy is right behind us and we won't make it without help. So we can escort the cargo ships to Akari base. I hate escort missions. I'm going to say that again. Fire warning shots at the attack ships or ignore the cargo ships and prepare to jump. Now here's the thing, I I'm sure that doing number one is going to not do a damn thing. And they're going to be like, oh cool, you want to fight and it'll fight me. And then I'll have to get stuck in this escort mission, which I really, really hate. Especially with, um, Ipek over here fucked up. But, we can ignore the cargo ship and just jump. But you know what, they're fellow Akaris. I'm not a hero, I've never said, I've said I'm a hero before, I'm not a hero, so... I'm going to just fire some warning shocks and hope that's enough. The Ritani dodged the gunfire with ease and move into the cargo ships. Now we could, you know, protect the cargo vessel so they can complete their deliveries, or we could avoid conflict with the Ritani and move on. So I tried my best. I just hate, um, escort missions so much. So much. I'm sorry, guys. I gotta go. <laughs> I gotta go. I apologize. I can't do this for you. You guys just need to go. You guys jump. Please stop dancing around. They were probably even hesitant. They're like, are you sure you're doing this, Falcon, you piece of shit? Yes, I'm sure what I'm doing, okay? It's not my fight. We're going to jump over to Cardine over here, which is one of the things that I really wanted to get to. And hopefully it's not too difficult for us. Let's find out. A recovery group has been dispatched to salvage what they can from the Irritani wreckage in the system. The engineer who grins out at the Visicom at you is clearly relish uh, relishing stripping down these ships. Just like Irritani jankies, eh? Blowing themselves up in the first opportunity. If it's attachments you want, war leader, you've come to the right place. Ooh, okay. Um, you don't have a way to heal my guy, though, do you? That's quite unfortunate. Quite unfortunate indeed. Alrighty, but he does have some attachments, and hopefully one of these will actually be for my Lancers, then. Assault, Dreadnought, and Gunship. That's not for my Lancer whatsoever. This is a Missile Auto Reloader 2. Don't we have one of these? No, no, we... We have missiles, for sure. But most of our upgrades are for the cannon itself. Advanced cannons, which is increases the damage of cannon type weapons, which is good. And we also have the auto reloader, which actually speeds up our rate of fire. Now for our missiles, we could get this right here, which increases the rate of fire. But then we'd have to drop the um, advanced cannons, which increases the damage. So we'd have two different weapons going at a bigger, a uh, faster rate of fire, which sounds pretty good. But at the same time, I feel like we should probably have two different type of weapons and not just focus on only cannons. So. Or, you know, missiles or cannons, so I'm going to bypass it for now. We have Tactical Overcharger 1. Um, wasn't this the one that we had? Well, we had a variation of this. It was the veteran one, right? For the Assault, so no. This is for Assault Dreadnought Lancer. Oh, you know, I could actually use that on one of my Lancers here. It increases damage of all weapons, so if I pump this along with our shot, it would probably be even more, you know, hard-hitting, which could be good. We also have this right here, which is Charge Shielding. Only available for Assault, Dreadnought, Lancer, Rogue, and Gunships. Increases the rate of shield regeneration. So would this counter effect Ipic's issue over here? Now mind you, this doesn't seem like the greatest thing. It only sounds like good to me because I'd imagine it would counter effect this critical that we have here. But at the same time, our Lancer shouldn't be in a situation where they're taking damage. That they need to charge the shielding charger. This would probably be better for either my tech or my Assault. So... Um, unfortunately, my tech cannot use this. It's only my Lancers or my Assault class. Oh, we have a few more down here, though. We have Unstable Reloader. Greatly increases the rate of fire of all weapons, but deals damage to own shields while active. 
Why Lord? That sounds like a, you know, glass cannon build if I've ever heard one. That's a pretty big increase in rate of fire, but yeah, it's going to be affecting my shields over time. I don't think I like that too much. Unless you use that along with, um... I can see you par pairing that up with the, the shield charger. Maybe like a level 2 shield, char uh, shield charger, though. That'd be pretty interesting. Don't we also have advanced missiles? 1. Increases damage of missile type weapons. Uh, let's see. And we have... Well, we have nothing for the missiles, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Advanced Cannons 2, Auto Reloader 1. This would just do increases damage. No, okay, I'm going to bypass this. Some of them sound good, but, you know, we're not really looking that great in scrap right now, so no, I'm going to bypass it. All right, we came down here. I gave it a try. Really nothing that I'm really interested in. I mean, I'm kind of interested in some of them, but I don't really have the funds for it. So let's jump over here and see what it's uh, awaiting us now. Your entire communications network lights up with the distress signals as you exit interspace. Ortani forces are fixating on several nurture stations in which the youngest Akari are raised. No honorable Akari would allow 10,000 progeny to perish. You move the fleet to engage. So we have to fight here regardless of which. I don't have the option to be a dick and be like, Oh, kids getting killed? That's okay, I just want to jump away. I don't have that option this time around. So we have to defend the orbital- Oh, come on. I hate it when you give me escort and defending missions. At least just have me go somewhere and kill something. That's more feasible for me. Okay, so we have to defend the stations. This is a danger level 9 of 10 mission, by the way. Um, things are going to be pretty bad. Let's just say it right now. Things are going to be pretty bad. Now, let's slowly move and be really careful what we're doing. Okay, we have some enemies already roaring up on us. This is scary. This is one of the um, shield fuckers, too. Okay. Um, here's what you need to do. Uh, Lancers, where are you? Tech, you need to get your ass a little bit up close here, number one. Assault, same thing right here. Let's, um, move the dudes away. Lancers, let's have you move back, okay? No, no reason to play the hero right now. Just move your asses, prefer- you can't move any further back than this, huh? That's rather unfortunate. What if I moved you here, then? Is that good for you? Yeah, okay. We'll move you a little bit. Oh, fuck. We have another dude over here attacking our Lancers from afar. So it's probably good that we're moving them away. All right. You guys get there as soon as possible. And just avoid damage for now. Let's see. What do we have here that we have to do? Assault and tech. Tech's just taking some pretty crazy hits to the shielding. So I'm thinking we go after shield fucker first, right? I mean, that's always the main thing. So tech class. Are you guys done moving? Kind of. Alrighty, we'll probably launch it right here. And then we have to go to Assault. And Assault, you have to go after this guy regardless of which, because he's the one causing the more the most grief for us. You guys are gonna be okay back here? Did I move you too far in? Scimitar. Let's have you Can you attack from back here is my real question. Um it seems like you probably can. Hmm. If you can, then never mind. Just hang out back there and take some shots in. We'll go after this guy then. And then, you guys should be setting up now. Oh, fuck! I hate that big shield-destroying fucking thing. Um, you launched your thing, so let's have you move. Assault class, let's have you move out of the way, too. Your shield is getting jacked. Oh, my fucking god. That's fucking horseshit! God damn, that's fucking annoying as hell. Look at that thing. It's fucking... Look how much it covers. Just destroyed my shields completely. I'm gonna be back in a situation where I'm just retreating over and over now. Ah, <sighs> the salt. The salt is fucking real at this point. You attack here. Epic, you attack here. Be careful with Epic again. He's got the lower shields of everybody that we have. Um, assault, you need to probably start going somewhere right now, my friend. You need to start going somewhere. Your shields are down completely. You need to move. You need to move. Um, did we do anything over here? I'm not sure if we did or not. And quite frankly, I don't even give a fuck. We need to move for now, get our shields back up, and that means you guys as well come along. In the meantime, this should hopefully give you some time to um, regenerate some shields. Come on, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Shields are charging up. Let's keep moving here for now. Do some tactical retreating. At least we're getting some shots off at the very least. Um, sh tech is actually going up. Assault, you need to do something pretty fast here. Let's, um, we can't zoom out anymore. This is as far as it's going? Okay. Move you up here. We need to keep moving here for now. 
now. I don't think we've taken down anybody in their crew, but we are doing some damage a little bit to their shields as we go along, so that's good. This guy's shields are almost down. Do I want to keep moving further back? I think I do, because my assault needs his shields before we go in there one more time. So you guys move back here, and then you guys follow suit. Just keep moving and keep dodging. Our shield should be coming up right now, which is good. Oh, fuck! But they're going to attack this! I forgot about the mission! <laughs> I forgot about defending the station! Okay. Um, problematic. How's your shield? Okay, we need to defend that pretty soon. Alright, the assault shields are back up too. That's good. Now then. Stop attacking it. Stop it right now, you pieces of shit. There are, there are kids in there, okay? Um, let's go... I could hit both of them if I move forward a bit. So as much as I don't want to, let's move you, like, up to here. It has a lot of HP at the very least, so there is that. And then you launch this right here in between these two fuckers. And his shields are down finally. So Assault, you could finally go in, balls to the wall. You do your Overcharger and attack him. Balak, give me some help with this guy. Epic, I preferably want you to go after these piece of shit right here. Okay. So you guys have taken your shots. Epic, did you ever... Oh, Epic's that side of your range, huh? No, no, no. Don't take the shot here. Don't take the shot there. Whatever I told you to do, stop. Oh, no, he's charging it already. Oh, yeah, did I cancel it? I think I canceled it. Good. Just click it again and it'll stop charging. Okay. This guy should be going down pretty soon, as a matter of fact. Um... You guys come close, just in case they're attacking more, which I believe they probably are. Okay, he's down now. Alright, Lancers, let's get down over here really quickly. Oh! <gasps> that was it! <laughs> oh, that was it! Oh, good god. That was scarier than I thought it would be, and you know what? Fuck that giant mist attack now. Like, why don't, why don't I get that? I want that. I want that in my life. How come I don't get that option at all? Alrighty, we have uh, more experience over here gained, and now Ipic and Bellic have um, ranked up to regular as well. Good, good, good. Okay, so the lives you the lives you saved here today will prove vital to the war effort. Aeos will be celebrating. So we got more scrap, no supplies unfortunately, but so be it. At least we got some scrap here. Now, let's jump. We're up to 10,000 again, which is good. If I could find a place to heal up my critical on Ipic, even though it didn't really affect me too much this time around, did it? But whatever. Let's jump over to here then, and from there we'll probably just go to the exit. Because the battles over here are getting a little bit tricky now. A red light winks on the console and your Jahoon makes contact. Greetings, war leader. Our analyst reports a 0 .0 or 0.72% chance of success for this mission, something you should obviously be trying to improve on. It is unlikely that the Urtani will suspect a direct strike against the Erebus platform at this stage, but be aware that they have dispatched Guardian fleets as a precautionary measure. Thank you for this information, my Jahoon. You are welcome, War Leader. Though, speaking of the Urtani, you may first want to deal with the fleet I mentioned. It has just warped in at your location. Oh, come on! Oh, yeah, what is this shit? Oh, hey guys, by the way, there's a- Oh! Hey! I was talking! Don't unpause the fucking game when I'm talking here. Never mind, alrighty, never mind my joke. Apparently there's no time for jokes right now. Okay. Um, that was fucking terrifying the way it just unpaused on me. Lancers, you need to move back here really quickly. Alrighty. So let's start moving about. Oh shit, this guy is charging up some crazy stuff here, and so is this guy. Um, this is terrifying as all hell. What are you doing, man? I'm gonna move back here for a while because I don't really like what's happening there with that charging thing. Don't like it at all. Oh! Oh, this guy is going to be the healer of this motherfucker. I getcha. I see the ga the name of your game here. So we need to get rid of this guy before we do anything else, right? Okay. That could be arranged. That could definitely be arranged here. Um, Lancers, let's have you move back. Completely back, because you can. Hey, you are part of the Lancer crew, my friend. Get your ass back here, too. So this guy needs to go down first and foremost. So we're going to mess around with his shields, number one. And then... Uh, you, my friend, just keep attacking him regularly. And as soon as my lancers are ready to go, which they... Oh, fuck, here comes this crazy barrage. That's gonna hurt a lot. Oh, fuck, that hurts so much. Uh, okay, epic. Let's attack over here. Bellic, attack over here. 
You can do your overcharger, and then we're going to attack over here. Shields took a lot of damage from our assault. So we're going to have to probably start doing some retreating pretty soon here. But I would like to get rid of at least one dude before we do that. Fuck me. Stop it with that shit. Come on, get rid of him. Get rid of him, goddammit. Um, do your shield fucker on both of these bad boys right here. Assault, just hang out there for a second. Oh, his shields are back up. No, 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 no. Are you guys not ready to shoot yet? You, God damn it. All right, we're going to have to start retreating pretty soon. As a matter of fact, we need to start retreating now. Even if we're about to take this guy down. We have, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. That was a lot of damage. Um, are you guys ready to shoot? I need to get rid of one of these guys at least. Okay, we got rid of him. Now what we do is um, we need to keep retreating here and to get our shields back up. Alrighty. So, Lancers, right now, you take your shots as soon as you can. But, here they come. Here they come. Um, his shields are almost down. We just need to make sure that our assault gets the shields back up before we do anything. Bellic, let's launch an attack right now. Epic, let's also launch an attack. And then you're about to get bombarded by this shit, so... Sumatar, let's have you... move back. And then your shields need to go up, so let's have you start moving back a bit more, too. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Please don't get fucked. <gasps> We're almost taking him down, though. No! He's gonna recharge! This was our chance! Hey, um... Sumitar, just stop what you're doing and shoot him, then. Turn around, my friend. And can you... actually land shots here? He's about to go down, and we might be able to do it as long as we... Oh, he's down. Perfect. I'm not as worried anymore with just this guy left. So now... You just focus over here. We're waiting for these guys to recharge, and then we can do our thing. You could probably go in for an attack now, because you have shields left over, at least. And I want you to do is actually just launch... Actually, we don't even need that anymore. Let's just do that. My shields are back up over here with the assault, so that's good. And you guys should be able to finish this off right now. Please tell me that's it. Of course not. <laughs> that would be too easy. Alrighty, shields up. Everybody's shields are back up. Get your shields back up. Whew. Okay. Oh, fuck. We have possibly a carrier now aboard. At least your shields are up. Let's get my Lancers to come down behind the line of fire. Oh, fuck. They're about to launch that missile thing on us. You guys need to move. So let's get close over here and let's get some eyes on what's happening. We have Shield Fucker. And he's going to probably have that giant mist thing that just destroys everything that we do. And now, the other scary thing is that these small dudes are going to be doing damage to my Lancers over time. That's a really good counter to them, by the way. I got to keep my eyes on when this guy shoots this thing as well. So here's what we do. You need to get closer, by the way. This guy's charging some shit up. I'm not sure what he is that he's charging. But we need to move closer in order to get some attacks off on him, it seems. Oof. What are you doing? What are you charging? There's a lot of these guys. And we have... Possible Lancer over here as well. Speaking of which, how are my Lancers doing? They're over here dealing with this clusterfuck of a thing. We should probably go back. And before we deal with this coming assault... Oh, no, 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 don't go through it! Oh, they're gonna go through it and fuck their shields up. This guy just aimed that shit so perfectly. I hate that miss so much. Lancers, move back. You guys keep moving back as well. So, we're gonna come back here just so that we can try to deal with these small little dudes. So I don't wreck our Lancers up too much. And we're going to continue just going downwards. And just getting our shields back up here meanwhile. And you guys need to get rid of this, uh, get out of the zone. Okay, come on. Let's deal with this shit right now. Everybody should be on an assault pattern. Just shooting all these small little dudes right now. Alright, here comes this shit. Um, let us... Uh, unselect everybody. We need to continue going downward now. So you guys come down to here, and then let's also come down through here. Keep moving. Keep moving. We need to get these shields back up. And we need to get rid of all these small little fucks as well. And let's also hopefully not run into another hidden platoon down here. That would be the scariest thing. And there's going to be another assault being launched in this circle, so we need to perhaps move our asses out of here. My shield's being regenerated by my assault class, which is good. And luckily, all the small dudes have been taken care of for the most part, so that does at least make me feel good for my Lancers. We could probably start taking some shots now, too. 
Um, this guy needs to go down, by the way. Him and his shield fucking abilities? Yeah, that needs to stop. Your shields are going up right now, which is good. Can I do the same over to him right now? Uh, no. He needs to get closer. He's getting closer. He's about to launch his, um, circular bullshit. So we launched ours. And now we... He's gonna shoot that big purple mist here again. We need to... Uh, we're gonna throw that thing to his shield right now and fuck it up. I wanna get rid of him as soon as possible. But it scares me to move these guys in close right now, too. Let's have you guys go through here, then. And do that really fast, because here comes that purple mist more than likely. And we're getting some attacks over here. Oh, that's a small dude. Okay. I could deal with one small little guy doing that. Um, are we messing their shields up? Yes. Barely. Oh, we got out of there just in time. We took some damage with our shield, with our tech class, but at least just in time. Now, Lancers, you need to start helping me out here. Um, preferably... We need to go after their Lancer, because that does damage. And then we have to go here and here. We just need to get rid of the Lancer right now. And then we'll focus on Shield Fucker. The thing is that he actually uses up all of his um, energy on his one thing. So he's not going to be that much of a problem as long as we get rid of him now. We took care of their Lancer, by the way. And how are you doing? Oh, fuck. Your shields are down and you're taking damage. You need to go. You need to go. You need to go. Go, 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 go. Get out of here. Just get out of here right now. Assault, you're not looking too great as well. You just need to keep going. Keep going, Tech. Just keep going away. Oh, fuck. They're still aiming at you. Jesus Christ, the range on these fuckers is redonkulous. Come down through here. Assault, how are you doing? You need to kind of um, hang in there a bit longer because now I'm going to be focusing with my Lancers. Uh, This guy needs to go, definitely, but so does this shit here. So let's just aim over here right now. This is about to come back online here, so we just gotta... Oh, no! No! No, no, no. Okay, we got rid of him. And now this guy is our next target here. Um, assault. You need to... I think everybody needs to start withdrawing, right? Yeah. We could probably get one attack off over here, but you know what? Let's not... Let's play it safe. Let's just keep moving for now. I hope we don't run into another platoon down here. But at the meantime, I think it's probably best we just start running, get our shields back up and recharged. Live to fight another day type of thing. Okay. Keep moving. Keep moving, guys. Oh, shit. Tech class is getting fucked. Tech's uh, shield should be coming up pretty soon, and so should my assault. It's got to wait it up like 15 more seconds, and we should be okay. Please don't run into another platoon. Okay. Um, we've outrun them a little bit. Lancers, you guys come back and hang out over here. Tech, let's get up close and personal. Assault, you're going to obviously back me up. Your shield should be coming up before we deal with them again. There it is. Perfect. Now, we have the advantage. You are just going to... Okay, stop moving. Stop moving, you pieces of shit. We need to go after this guy. He worries me with his shield capabilities of taking him down. And then you are just going to focus on him as well. We need to get rid of him as soon as possible. Oh, here comes the shield fucking thing. God damn it, he did it again. But so did we, so you know what? Move as soon as possible. Assault class, also move, please. Alrighty. And then you guys... Shoot. Oh, it's out of your range. How? God damn it, Lancers. You have one job. It's out of your range. You have one job. God damn it. No. Don't charge that here. Let's move you guys a little bit closer, I guess. Tech, how are you doing? You're still alive. This piece of shit needs to go down as soon as possible. Your shields are about to go down, and this guy's still kind of actively fucking me here. Um, drop this over here on him, and then once he, you do that, you need to run. You are going to have to go away. So, you've launched it. Let's have you just amscray the fuck out of here. His shields are going to be going down. Now, good. Now, Lancers, please. You shoot over here. Epic. You shoot over here. You overcharge and do this. I should be able to take this guy down with my assault. He's down, and now this guy should be coming in next. Hooey. Hooey. We might just pull through, guys. Please tell me that's it. I don't want to do it anymore. Oh, I have to do it some more. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, <laughs> oh god damn it, game. Don't give me that little fucking false sense of, um... Oh, there's still enemies aboard. Oh, 940 experience. Okay.
High Command may have plenty of analysis focused on this warp, but a little more warning about that attack would have not gotten him. That was going to be my, my, oh, I got a gunship, by the way. That was going to be my joke. Remember when I got, you know, when the game suddenly unpaused him, it was going to be like, oh, a little bit more warning would be nice. Like, oh, hey, by the way, there's enemies right there next to you. Son of a bitch. We had a gunship, though. Now, here's the, here's the decision for us to make. I have not messed around with the gunships before. I don't know how it work. They deal moderate damage, or deals moderate sustained damage to enemies, but has a greater survivability than its burst damage counterparts. So, um, how is your, your weapon of choice here? What's your weapon of choice? I'm not sure. Um, what's your weapon? God damn it. How do I look at this? Weapons over here. What is that? Burst Cannon 1. Standard Issue Cannon. Burst Cannon, huh? Well, we have a Repeater Cannon. Strike Missiles. And we also have this Experimental Lance. And what do you have? You have the Breach Beam. I don't know. I really know about this guy. I mean, chances are... This would probably be, you're probably thinking, this is probably the best time to get rid of um, Ipic because he's got that critical on him. So why not do that? Excuse me, what is this? <gasps> I've been rolling without activating skills because I'm an idiot? So in a sense, my own idiocy, I've been making the game more difficult on myself just by being a fucking moron, that's what you're telling me. Okay, whatever. Okay, here's what I, here's my not I'm not trying to, you know, play it off. I thought when I leveled up and I said you have a new slot available, I thought I meant one of these guys, and I was like, well that's cool and all, but I don't really have the money to actually fill up with any scraps. Now you could probably say, well, didn't you notice that there was no empty slot there next to them after you got that? And you're right. Stop questioning it so much, I'm an idiot, we all know that. Hey, you know what? I've been making the game difficult for myself. For all I for all you know, this is basically a self-imposed challenge. Let's make the game as difficult as possible for myself. And I'm still winning. Like Charlie Sheen once said, okay, that's so outdated at this point. All right, so we have some skills. Let's use these really quickly. Shield phasing. Engineers on this ship have learned to moderate defensive fields more effectively, allowing them to slowly regenerate shields while under fire. At shield regeneration while taking damage. So good for assault easily. Combat piloting. Increased familiarity with the ship's combat handling and new modifications to the ship's controls. Profiles have increased the maximum speed of the ship. I could, I could see speed being uh, useful for the assault on occasion. Advanced gunnery. The gunnery crew have gained more expertise in targeting the ship's weaponry. Increase the amount of damage all weapons inflict. That sounds pretty good because we have some pretty decent weapons, but you know what? I use my assault as our damage sponge, so I think we have to go with the shield phasing. So let's confirm that right now. Okay. Now, Lancer. You have patching and reinforcing the ship's internal superstructure over several battles has increased its maximum hull, so this will give me more HP basically. Um, improved shield cohesion. The crew on the ship have found new ways to manually reroute energy-based subsystems as the shields are powering up. Increasing the rate of shield regeneration. I guess that could be pretty good. Combat piloting. Increase, and this is going to be speed, right? Um, for my Lancers, I feel they're fast enough as it is. You probably are thinking we should go with this one for more HP because they have so little HP. And I agree, but at the same time, whenever their shields go down, I usually send them out of battle. Like, way out of battle. So maybe because of that... Shield regeneration will probably be a bit better, so I'm going to grab that for that Lancer. Now for the tech, for the tech, you have um, reinforced superstructure. Patching and reinforcing the ship's internal superstructure over several battles has increased its maximum hull, so more HP. Override firing. The gunnery crew has removed safety locks and re-engineered many of the gunnery mechanisms, increasing the rate of fire on all automatic shipboard weapons. And we have the reactor overhaul. The reactor for this vessel has been re-engineered over numerous combat engagements, increasing its maximum energy output. So this will give me more energy so we could kind of launch our our skills more often. I like that. I'm not too crazy about this one. Neither am I too crazy about this one as well. Mm. Yeah, you know what? Let's go with the reactor overhaul. So we can just kind of um spam our skills. And we know what we want to do with our Lancers, and that is just give them the... What was it I was going to give them? Wait, do you guys have different skills or what? This Lancer, we got him the improved shield cohesion, right? So he should probably have the same one. Oh no, they all have different skills. I thought it was basically based on class. So the Epic, for instance, could get the combat piling, which is more speed. We could go for more shields. 
And shield phasing. Oh, so this one actually lets me do the regen while taking damage. I kind of like um, increasing my shields altogether for the um, for the Lancer for this one. So yeah, we'll go with that one right here. And then for this Lancer, we have more HP, um, shield regeneration, or shield phasing. We're going to go with um, shield cohesion right here. Okay. Well, there you go. And in terms of the gunship, I am going to probably... I could dump Epic because we got that critical on him. And go with this gunship. But. No. We're just going to scrap the gunship. Okay. And now we're almost up to 20,000. 10 supplies. We're looking pretty goddamn well over here. And we're going to call it an episode here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a like. The support does me a lot. Our mission continues. And you know what? This should take us to the next node. And also lower our danger level quite a bit. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I'm an idiot. But at least I figured it out. And you know what? It kind of goes to prove my MLG skill in a sense, right? I'm over here fighting this game, a difficult game without, you know, increasing my skills. Who does that? I'll catch you next time.